How doing YouTube? It's Darren from Pedpgack here, back with another video to help solve life's little technical issues. Hopefully you've found this video because you're experiencing an issue whereby on your keyboard, your left alt and your Windows key, key, Windows key have swapped. So when you're pressing the Windows key, it's doing the alt functions. When you're pressing the alt key, it's doing the Windows functions and it's driving you mad and you're not sure how to fix it. Well, thankfully, I've got four options on how to fix that for you. I'm going to run you through them all, start with the easiest, through the most difficult. And if they don't help, make sure you leave a comment below and I might choose you to do a free support session with and fix the issue for you. Right, I don't want to keep you hanging around. So without further ado, let's get into it. So what you're going to want to do, and this is applies to all keyboards, but mainly on laptops. But a lot of keyboards have a function key. Now, the function key on your keyboard may say function, or it may just be like this, where it's got an FN. Uh, not necessarily in that position, just have a look around on your keyboard, look for one that says function or FN. What you're going to want to do is one of three different key combinations might solve this for you. So hold down the FN key and press the letter A. If that doesn't fix it, do it again, hold down the FN key, but press the letter S for Sierra. If that doesn't do it, then hold down the FN key and the space bar for about three seconds. Now, that will fix it on certain keyboard types. If that doesn't fix it for you, then if you're using a Keychron keyboard, uh, which I've seen a lot of users having this issue with Keychron keyboards, specifically because they have this little switch. So over on the left-hand side, it looks like on that keyboard, there is the Bluetooth on and off and USB button but there's also this little toggle switch for Windows slash Mac OS. What that does is that toggles the mode of the keyboard for a Windows keyboard or a Mac OS keyboard, which switches the functions of those keys around. Just make sure you've got it in the right one for your operating system, obviously Windows for Windows, Mac for Apple, uh, and give that a go. Right, so if the function key and didn't work and you don't have a Keychron keyboard, there's one last thing you can try. Sorry, not the last thing. One more thing you can try here, and that is go back to Windows, click on your Start menu, type Device Manager, and when it comes up, click on it. You're going to look in here for your keyboard. I'm using a virtual machine, so mine look a bit weird, but you'll have your keyboard listed in here. You're going to right-click. You're going to choose Uninstall Device. Once you've done that, give your computer a restart. It will automatically reinstall that keyboard. Don't worry, you're not going to lose your keyboard device. And hopefully if you've accidentally enabled a setting on your keyboard, you've clicked some wrong function keys, that will also just put it back to default and you'll have your Windows and Alt keys back. If that still doesn't help, then the last option I've got for you is, as I said at the beginning, leave a comment down below. Uh, I'll get in touch. We'll see if we can arrange a time to do a free support session. Uh, always happy to do that, and it's how I grow my YouTube channel is by doing free support for people. If this did help and you want to say thank you, then please buy me a coffee. Uh, link on the screen and down in the description below. Otherwise, if you don't want to do that, please just comment, like, subscribe, all the usual things that feed the algorithm, and I'd be eternally grateful. But other than that, have a great day.